Like, stir. It was a little bigger than what I expected. And it's gonna take a lot of glue, but this beloved brontosaurus is finally getting its head back. Shaping the head and remodeling the head. I'm gonna go in there and sculpt some teeth. The giant was decapitated by teen pranksters almost two months ago. I didn't expect to be a dentist and a surgeon and all this stuff. I have to form new crowns and stuff for his teeth and I got to reconstruct his insides. I couldn't imagine why anybody would want to do something like this. What would be the motivation for doing something like this? So, I mean, it was really disbelief and then just really very strong disappointment that somebody would even think to do uh, an act like this. The Save the Bronto Committee is selling t-shirts to raise money for the repairs. We just received a check in the mail today that puts us over our uh, initial $2,000 goal. I've gotten at least 20 emails a day from people all over the country who are saying things like, I want to support what you're doing, send me a t-shirt, or here's a donation. What comes to mind is it's like our own little Statue of Liberty. The pranksters have since been punished. The kids will be doing uh, some work at the museum, I understand. There has been money that the parents have had to pay. I think people are pretty comfortable with the way things worked out.